Lucina doesn't have a tip, so would she just really just be taking oh. the roller and just like slapping him across the hand with it? If he has no tip, that just means uh, he's giving him a very vague liberal directions. arts degree. It's not a specialized <laughs> degree, okay? That's all that means. Oof. Oh, this is winner's quarters, thing. And we got Dexter. Dexter looking like he's smelling something because of how he's uh, <laughs> leaned forward right there. Word, like, something it's, smells good. It, I always just think it looks like someone's smelling something when their nose is like directly lined On the up green line. with the bottom Oh, never mind. It. It's Thanks, just Vince. Funny. But Vince. now he is no longer interested in that smell. He is back in this game. Oof. Can he he locking him with the down air? That was a really weird interaction. It I'm was. Not gonna lie. There's a jab mm. grab. There All was right. the one. That was that was a go that was a go for it moment. All right. Is Here he we go do again. again. No. Nah, he's like out of the percent. He out might. He might. Yeah, he might be like trying to get him to two. But it looked like he's out of it now. Actually, he I don't. Might I don't know the percent. So I'm gonna be straight. We've seen us fairly floaty, so this should be two two. Ooh, actually falling out of the second hit. So now he has to go for a conventional air dodge, trying to catch him with the uppy. It looked working. like he got out of it with a sort of horizontal mix up the eye. It looked like he went left then right. Yeah. And uh, Dingus tried to follow him, Ooh. but then he like over uh, shot. Right there, though, Good did not Erdogan. overshoot oh. that one. He's going to taunt him. Yikes. I don't know whether Dingus is feeling himself. Or, or I'm pretty sure he is, if he's going for the taunt. Dingus saying, I've already graduated. I'm not here to learn crap. This a game to watch has no concept of Ooh. good and evil. And he's going to get sliced not in half because he's a 2D <laughs> Why does character. everyone keep bringing that up? Because <laughs> the, the whole Frostbite trip, at least twice a day, Dingus would say. Well, well he's the one who told me I earlier. Know. Did you know Mr. Game Watch doesn't have any concept of yes, good and, and evil? Yes, and then I said that must be a third dimension concept. <laughs> All right. Speaking of third or two dimensional, let's talk about uh, this Lucina play right now. Well, <laughs> I'm not trying to come on man's Dexter, but I mean, the game plan's sort of working out. Space them out, or not even space them out. Just throw out these hitboxes, keep Game and Watch off of them. Now, here's my question. Why do you think Dexter went Lucina over Marth in this matchup? I would think Tipper's going to kill Game and Watch very early. He's light character. Tipper does kill earlier, but especially in this matchup, you want to just be able to, like, a lot of what Game and Watch does is, like, bait and punish. In order to break in, normally he's fast enough on the ground to just run in and shield whatever spaced moves uh that Marcina tries to throw out since um, they're fairly floaty and they don't have the greatest aerial drift to space away. And so Lucina, if uh, Game Watch tries to run in Power Shield, uh, Lucina can just like wall it out over and over. Whereas if you're Marf and you get caught in that sour zone, then Game Watch gets a free punish because he's already in there. Hmm. I don't know if I agree with that. I don't know if that's worth it. I think it is. He's down one percent. Is he gonna be able to? Ooh, yes. He's gonna all, eat him he with just the up walks tilt. back with confidence and says, "Class dismissed." <laughs> Good roll, Raid. <laughs> Out of here. All right, Dingus Joe literally beating himself up over that one, hitting himself in the leg. Dexter saying, "I'm not even up." That didn't even wake me up, man. Mm -mm. I'm not even woke. I'm sleep. He's still sleep. He's in this <laughs> joke. To Here's a joke. <laughs> Dexter using Marf. Haha. <laughs> just how you stay woke. Dexter using Lucina, haha. <laughs> Cause he's right. gonna win him this. I don't want to say that though. Let's go, Dingus Joe. Let's go. Dexter. I mean, to be honest, in my opinion, Dingus Joe had last game. What I would have corrected in his play was merely don't go for Hammer, hmm. because he gave up a lot of follow-ups that were guaranteed damage, and he already had to bring it back hmm. at the end of that. So if he had, if he just went for picking him apart and hmm. not like kill setups and like, no, I'm just gonna keep picking him apart. It might be better to just play this patiently like that. True. Instead of uh, feeling like he has to get a kill at any point. Good dancing blade out of that, by the way. But, um, I mean, uh, Lucina's kill uh, options are very limited as compared to Marth. So you can kind of know what they're going to go for and just avoid that option a lot more. Trapping him on ledge with the bacon, not quite landing the nair. That was just, I think he held back. I think he was trying to cover an air dodge. I think. And he needed to just commit yeah. to one option. I also think uh, he thought that uh, Dexter was going to try and drift in. Just to avoid being sent to the offstage, but guess not. Dexter now in the two toot range. He's going to be fairly careful about getting grabbed. All right, There's the go. grab, and, and that should be the... Oh, oh I like too far out. What I like what he, he went for a read there. I like that because he was uh, adapting to something Bush. that happened last round, and it's Think good, it's good to just put someone on notice. Like, I'm not going to let you do that. So now you know Dexter's not going to go left next time. He's yeah. going to lock into the same DI. So if he gets another grab, 
he probably will drift right to kill him this time. Who's going to kill him with the down air, actually? Because I was about to say, uh, another grab for Joe wouldn't have done him much good. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, at that point. Trying to catch him. Oh, I like it, though. Please, oh, no there's nine. A thing is, is Chanu just essentially, his mentality behind using hammer or when to use hammer is when you've got the lead. Because it could seal the game when you need to. And it's honestly, like, if you're up and you're confident in your play, then you can just throw it out and you only benefit or you lose the stock, which I guess isn't a benefit, but Dingus knows more about the character than I do. So I think what he should be doing is going for frustration. The he has butters. the lead. He has the lead. He has very good uh, low percent combos against everyone almost. Mm. He should just keep frustrating him like he is now, picking him apart slowly by slowly because he's going to need as big of a lead as he can get if he dies. I think Dexter actually just flew out of Toot Toot, and as I say that, he's back in it. He is, but um, Game & Watch has a very significant lead. If he just plays very patiently and forces Lucina to come to him, I don't really know what she can do about that. But yeah. instead, he's going in on the aggressive because what he feels like is, oh, I have the lead so I can afford to take some hits. But you really don't want to think that way in this mm. situation. Especially against Lucina with Rage. Exactly, anyone with Rage Ooh, in your Game & Watch. You really don't want to. You don't really want to force neutral. You want to. You want to force them to approach you the way you want. So you have the lead. There's only three minutes left of the match. But now you see he's just giving away 60 percent. Now he's essentially in kill percent as well. Yeah. Oh, he's got to wash that. Oh my! And now Ooh. he was forced to hit his shield. That should be toot toot. No air dodge from Dexter. Good wait. Oh, I like that. I like that. Oh. Both of them have to be very careful, and that should be the stock, and that is the game. And he essentially throws away that game. He threw away the first game a little less, 